Hey guys, it's Zover and I am doing a new Let's Play, which is Fallout New Vegas, if you haven't already seen the title or haven't seen the little thing that's coming in. And I'm in the party chat just to kind of sync it up, make it easier. So yeah, this is the second out of the three videos I'm uploading because I'm not sure whether I'm going to do one tomorrow, so I'm just going to make like loads do a new game because I haven't actually played this that much. Literally I just did the little introduction bit which you'll probably see in a minute. Well now. And whenever there's like cutscenes I'm just not gonna talk so Atomic fire consumed the earth. Those who survived did so in great underground vaults. When they opened, their inhabitants set out across the ruins of the old world to build new societies, establishing villages, forming tribes. As decades passed, what had been the American Southwest united beneath the flag of the new California Republic dedicated to old world values of democracy and the rule of law. As the Republic grew, so did its needs. Scouts spread east, seeking territory and wealth in the dry and merciless expanse of the Mojave Desert. They returned with tales of a city untouched by the warheads that had scorched the rest of the world, and a great wall spanning the Colorado River. The NCR mobilized its army and sent it east to occupy Hoover Dam and restore it to working condition. But across the Colorado, another society had arisen under a different flag. A vast army of slaves forged from the conquest of 86 tribes, Caesar's Legion. Four years have passed since the Republic held the dam just barely against the Legion's onslaught. The Legion did not retreat. Across the river, it gathers strength. Campfires burn, training drum beat. Through it all, the New Vegas Strip has stayed open for business, under the control of its mysterious overseer, Mr. House, and his army of rehabilitated tribals and police robots. You are a courier hired by the Mojave Express to deliver a package to the New Vegas Strip. What seemed like a simple delivery job has taken a turn for the worse. You got what you were after, so pay up. You're crying in the rain, Pally. <laughs> Guess who's waking up over here? Time to cash out. Will you get it over with? Maybe cons kill people without looking them in the face. But I ain't a fink, Dig. You've made your last delivery, kid. Sorry you got twisted up in this scene. From where you're kneeling must seem like an 18-carat run of bad luck. Truth is... 
game was rigged from the start. seen after that as well so yeah I think this episode's probably just gonna be cutscene so I probably won't just class it as episode one it'll just be introduction or something but yeah whenever there's a cutscene I'm just not gonna talk I'll just let the cutscene play through you're awake how about that Whoa, easy there, easy. You've been out cold a couple of days now. Why don't you just relax a second? Get your bearings. Let's see what the damage is. How about your name? Can you tell me your name? your name. I'm Doc Mitchell. Welcome to Good Springs. Now, I hope you don't mind, but I had to go rooting around there in your noggin to pull all the bits of lead out. I take pride in my needlework, but you'd better tell me if I left anything out of place. How'd I do? of it right anyway. Stuff that mattered. Okay. No sense keeping you in bed anymore. Let's see if we can get you on your feet. Good. Why don't you walk down to the end of the room? Over by that bigger tester machine there. Take it slow now. It ain't a race. That's a pretty standard score there, but after what you've been through, I'd say that's great news. Well, we know your vitals are good, but that don't mean them bullets didn't leave you nuttered in a big one and drop them. What do you say you take a seat in my couch and we go through See if your dog is still barking. All right. I'm going to say a word. I want you to say the first thing that comes to mind. Now I'm just skipping through this because uh, it doesn't really matter too much. Because you can change it at the end.
Before I turn you loose, I need one more thing from you. You got a form for you to fill out so I can get a sense of your medical history. Just a formality. Ain't like I expect to find you got a family history of getting shot in the head. After this slow cutscene's finished. You All right, now I'm gonna end it here. So this isn't really gonna be an episode. It's just gonna be a uh, introduction. So yeah, hope you enjoyed it. This is just an introduction, so I don't really. It's not really an episode. So I'm gonna do episode one. It's like pretty much straight after this. So if you like it. If you like the series, just leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Bye.